If you have the Samsung Galaxy S24, the Galaxy S24 Plus, or the Galaxy S24 Ultra, then I can show you how to boot your smartphone into a special boot mode known as download mode. For most people, download mode is a way to manually flash firmware images to the device. And that's going to be required since Samsung devices do not ship with the typical fast boot mode feature. Now, before we begin, we are going to need a PC with a USB cable that we can connect the devices together with. I have read that some people were able to do this with a USB-C pair of headphones, but I have not been able to test that specifically. So in today's demonstration, I'll be showing you how this is done with a USB cable that is connected to the desktop PC that I have here at my desk. Also, if you're having trouble doing this with a USB hub, then connect that cable directly to the desktop or laptop computer instead, and then try again. Now, when you're ready, we're going to power down the Galaxy S24, S24 Plus, or S24 Ultra that you own. Now, whenever you see the screen go black, it's usually best to wait another 5 to 10 seconds to make sure that it is completely shut down. Then, we're going to press and hold both the volume up and the volume down buttons together at the same time. And then, while we are holding these two buttons down, we're going to connect our USB cable to the smartphone. So you can see here, we're going to press and hold both volume buttons. And while those buttons are held, I'm going to insert this USB cable. After that cable has been inserted, I'm going to continue to hold those two buttons down until you see the download mode splash screen appear. Now I did say splash screen because while this may look like you're in download mode right now, we can actually back out if you found yourself here by accident. So if you see this screen and you want to exit and go back to Android, you can simply press the volume down button and you will cancel booting into download mode and just restart back into Android. However, when you're ready to proceed, we simply need to press the volume up button and that's going to send us into download mode. So from here, we can then open up Odin on the PC and begin flashing firmware image files to the device. Or, if you have a Linux PC, then you could use an open source alternative called Heimdall. And I have a video here on the channel that shows you how to set that Linux alternative up if you are interested. When you are ready to leave download mode, make sure that you are not currently flashing a file via Odin. Because even though this page says downloading, it's not actually doing anything unless you have initiated something via the computer that's connected to the device with that USB cable. In fact, just to be safe, I have unplugged the USB cable from the device so that I know there's not any activity being downloaded to our device. And when you're ready to reboot and go back into Android, we're just going to follow the instructions here on the screen. So we can press and hold the volume down and the side key, AKA the power button for more than seven seconds. So I'm gonna press those two buttons down and I'm gonna continue holding these two buttons until I see that screen go black again. Mm -hmm. 
No. As long as you don't have any issues with your Android file system, we should see the phone reboot and it's going to boot us right back into Android. I hope this video has helped anyone who has been curious to learn how to access download mode on their Galaxy S24, S24 Plus, or S24 Ultra. If you had any trouble following the steps that I mentioned in this video, then please do not hesitate to leave a comment down below, and I'll do my best to reply to all of them when I'm able to.